Midnight is a character that was introduced to us um, by Sister Soldier in The Coldest Winter Ever, which is a book she written earlier. Um, he was not the star of the book, but he was, he did play a major role, um, and it was exciting to see Sister Soldier take him and finally explain, you know, why he was the way he was, because in the coldest winter ever, he was very different. Um, Midnight, um... Is a Af is an African male. He's from Africa, but he's here in the United States because of complications that has happened um, in his homeland. That's not explained to us as of yet. Um, hopefully, it will be explained eventually. You know why he even came to America with his mom and his younger sister, but it's not explained as of yet why he is here in America. Midnight is a very um, educated young man. Um, he's very wise for his time. Um, and the wisdom that he has, he has it because um, he grew up in a very structured family um, in Sudan. And, um, you know, he often reflects on things that his father has talk to him about and I guess from even watching his father growing up and how he conducted himself, Midnight has been able to take that knowledge and that wisdom that he learned from his father and from his family and use it to his advantage in America. And Midnight to me represents um who the African American man could be. And I say that, I don't say it to downplay any African American men or women um, at all, but I think what Sister Soldier wanted to show is how the black man could be. Um, in my opinion, Midnight is um, how the black man is supposed to act, think, and love. And I don't say that in any way to downgrade any black man. Um, I think that is how he was written to um, to um, be an example or be, I guess, give us a glimpse of what it could be. And it still could be that way today. So um, um, when I remove myself and when I get over the hurt and the pain of how African Americans are portrayed in this book, um, then I can see that. I can recognize that, that you know, if we were in an environment um, what, where Midnight has grown up with this foundation, this steady, concrete foundation, then the possibilities are endless to what we can do and what we can achieve. The thing that separates Midnight from the average African American man is the fact that he has a past. He has a lineage. Um, he even discusses it in the book. Um, he talks about the fact that he, um, his wisdom that he has learned from his father is from his father's father. And his father's father is knowledge that has been passed on from generation to generation. He has a name that can be traced back and back and back and back. And um, right out of the gate, that is what separates him from the average African-American male um, in the United States. So a lot of us don't know who we are.